Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Matt Shea 369 Super Search and Simulator Subscriber Special. And first of all, I just want to say, if you look right here, all the operations are gone. I don't have any operations. What am I going to do? I'm going to beat every single one over again. That's right. Uh, if you guys are watching this video, it means that I've finally hit 5,000 subscribers. That is a huge amount of subscribers. And I am extremely thankful to each and every one of you for playing your part and getting me where I am today. It's way earlier than I hoped as well. I was hoping to get here around Christmas, and that was even, for me, seemed a bit of a stretch. But uh, I'm here. 5,000 subscribers. Thank you so much. And I have all the questions, not all the questions, a lot of the questions that you guys have asked. And I've got uh, three sheets of paper here, and I'm going to do some questions. Uh, going to read some questions, give you some answers, and let's start the Surgeon Simulator. Got to start with our hand transplant, and let's get to the first question. Yfly963 says, Hey Matt, how's your day going? Well, my day is going pretty great. I only had school for an hour today, which is good, because I don't really like going to school that much. So, that's that. And I've also almost gotten to 5,000 subscribers. That is cool. I'm currently 15 away, so when you guys watch this video, I will indeed have 5,000 subscribers. So, let's move on to our second question, and I also have to try and play this game at the same time. Hmm. <clears throat> Agility Orb says... What made you begin your YouTube career? Well, Mr. Agility Orb, I began my YouTube career when I finally had the opportunity to actually do it. Um, I liked making videos. I used to make videos a couple years ago. I made a few while I was in school. You know, Let's Play was becoming a popular thing then, and Minecraft just got popular, and I decided, hey... Maybe I should do some videos. Only did a couple because uh, I didn't really have the equipment to do it. I only had a little MacBook Pro and I managed to do some videos. One of them got really popular. I got a few subscribers. Nothing crazy. Didn't really do anything with it. But uh, eventually I moved away and I had the opportunity to make some videos. I, I moved into a better apartment where I had more space to do my own thing without interruption. And I also got a gaming PC, which was good because, you know, you kind of need a gaming PC if you're going to be doing gaming videos, right? Unless you do them on console. But anyway, that's what happened for me, and I just decided, hey, maybe I should make some videos. Made a video. Uh, one of my videos got really popular on Reddit, and then I decided, let's make more videos. People demanded that I do Let's Plays, and I said, fine, I'll do Let's Plays. And some people liked it, including you guys who are currently watching this video. So, so uh, what's the word I'm looking for? So interested lingly I made that up but you can use it I give you permission anyway let's go on to the next question vlog 369 that's that's part of my name will you do more vlogs I counted the come here to ask questions vid as a vlog because you showed your beautiful face oh thank you everybody is doing them but hey why not we would like to know who is Matt Shea Whew. okay well is that part of the question are you asking me who is Matt Matt Shea well I'm 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 just that I'm Matt Shea I'm 20 years old, uh, from Newfoundland, Canada, and I like to play video games. I also like to occasionally ride a unicycle and all that good stuff that you didn't know, but ma maybe I'll tell you some more later. And another question, hmm, what else we got here? Lots of Low asks, coffee or tea? What coffee slash tea brand do you drink? Well, I don't drink much of either, but uh, I do like tea much more than coffee. Uh, if you are familiar with this, the the tea chain, I guess, like the franchise David's Tea. I buy tea from there now and then. It's not bad. I like fruitier teas. I'm not much of a, like a, I don't know, the weird green tea and shit. I don't really drink a whole lot of that. I don't like to taste much. I like something sweet. I also use a ton of sugar. Next question. <clears throat> Get in there. There we go. Alright, that's two completed. Next question. I Love Panda says, if you could meet any historical person, who would it be and why? Well, historical people. Who is a historical person that I might like to meet? Well, if I met Hitler, I'd probably punch him in the dick repeatedly, so can I go with that? I'd like to meet Hitler and punch him in the dick. You know, someone in my history who I haven't met is my grandfather. I wouldn't mind meeting him either. He seemed like a pretty cool guy. He died when my dad was 17, so I didn't really get much of a chance since my dad didn't have me. Well, my dad didn't have me at all. My mom had me. But it wasn't until they were like 30 years old, so... Or 35 or something, I don't know, I'm the last child. I have a brother and a sister who are older than me. So yeah, one of those two would be pretty great to me, you know what I mean? <laughs> Alright, what's the next question here? Stick that brain in there. 
forget about that. It's a C? What do you mean a C? Oh, fuck you too. <clears throat> Blue Jumper says, what is your favorite element on the periodic table? My favorite element on the periodic table is antimony because... Come on, that's a pretty cool name for an element. I don't even know if that's exactly why you say antimony. Is that even on there? Is that on the periodic table? I swear it is. I swear it is. <clears throat> TNT is cool 54 says, why did you start YouTube? Most basic question I know, but sad face. Don't be sad. It's a good question. I kind of already answered it, didn't I? Um, not that you knew that, but uh, I, I pretty much answered that. And, um, you know... I just started YouTube because I like to talk a lot, okay? People always get mad at me because I talk too much, so when I do it on the internet, it uh, it's kind of like a release for me. I can I can talk. What am I even doing here? Why am I why am I doing it like this? Shouldn't I, you know, take the the lungs out first? Anyway, when I talk on the internet, people are like, "Oh yay, Matt's talking on the internet." And when people when I do it in real life, it's like, "Oh, Matt's talking." So you know, it's uh it's it's good shit because because holy shit, what the hell is going on in this goddamn ambulance? Um. Yes, that's why I started, because I just like to talk a lot. It's one of the reasons, anyway. Also, I want to be famous, and I want everybody to know who the hell Matt is. And that's part of the reason why you were watching this video, to find out. <clears throat> Next question. I should probably stop clearing my throat. Is that annoying? You, <laughs> I'll never know until this video is over. Grab the new heart first. I can't concentrate on doing everything at once, guys. Come on. Go in there. There you go. Come on. Come on. Forget it. Forget it. Motherfucker. That's gonna roll away, isn't it? I'm gonna waste time here. Next question, Matt. <clears throat> Creeper Brian03 says, Is your real name Matt? Well, yes, my real name is Matt. You think I'd make up a name as stupid as Matt Shea for a channel name? No. I wouldn't. That's a pretty bad name for like a like an, an alias. No. Maybe something cool like I don't know. What's a cool name? Forget it. I don't even know any cool names. Noah, Rod Noah Rodriguez says, Are you ever going to do a Minecraft series? Uh, my first comment on that would be fuck that. Because I tried to do one before and I just realized that Minecraft is kind of boring. No offense to anyone who enjoys Minecraft. I used to play Minecraft a lot. I just kind of gave up on it eventually. But I don't know. It's not really uh, my thing to do a series on that. I'm more of a play new exciting games. And, you know, there's some cool things you can do in Minecraft, but no, the answer is I will not be doing a Minecraft series anytime soon, at least. YDHate says, who did your YouTube profile picture? A guy by the name of Clay did that, and uh, you can check out his uh, his Tumblr. It's actually on my, my, uh, my profile page, my YouTube channel, if you look in the info. It's his his, uh, his Tumblr is Tiavo T I A V O dot Tumblr dot com. So you can check him out there if you'd like. He's a cool guy. So I, w I would recommend it. Hey, you see that? See that number right there? Uh, where'd it go? Anyway, if you turn this a certain way, you see the number number nineteen, eighteen, something like that. That's because of the ARG. Matt is da best four six nine. Okay, you could have at least put. 369 there, but I'll, I'll, I'll thank you for, you know, calling me the best. That's always a good thing to be called the best. You asked, how does it feel to know that you are making so many lives better, including mine? I'm in a rough patch right now. Well, until I did this, I didn't really realize I was making any lives better, but uh, it feels great. I, uh, I love making people happy. And if I can even make one person happy, you, Mr. Matt, is the best. If I can even just make you happy, that is good enough for me. That means that I've fulfilled my purpose as a YouTuber. Okay, let's look at the next question. Jay says, Okay, if you were stuck between performing oral sex to a lubed up walrus or anal sex with a shaved German Shepherd in yellow lingerie, which one would you film a porno with? Well, in order to answer that question, I need to ask you a question. Do I get to use a condom with the walrus? Because if I get to use a condom with the walrus, I think it wouldn't be really as, as bad of an animal cruelty thing than if I had sex with a German Shepherd. That seems kind of cruel, all right? So I would go with the walrus, all right, okay. Ethan, aka my friend Milky Mushrooms, says, who are your favorite YouTubers to watch? Mine are you and Onison. Well, I'm flattered that I am one of your favorite YouTubers to watch. I enjoy watching Robaz, Nerd Cubed. Uh, I watch some Markiplier now and then as well. They're all good YouTubers. Uh, other than, um, 
a non let's play or non uh, you know uh, gaming Jax Films is a pretty funny guy I like Jax Films I've been watching him for a while I, I uh, actually stopped for a long time because I didn't do much on YouTube or watch much on YouTube for a long time but I started watching him again recently and your grammar sucks is pretty goddamn funny Alexander says hey Matt I'm 14 I want to get into commentating videos hold one moment Alexander I got shit to do eh. there we go he says, I know I'm at a young age, so it is a small possibility. So I was wondering if there's anything you would recommend for me to get started. And how's your day been? My day's been good, like I said. And to get started, just, just do your thing, man. Just do it. Just It's all about practicing, getting better at talking. That's where you gotta start. Don't worry if your channel doesn't go anywhere right away, because, I mean, you gotta start somewhere, right? And the best place, I think, to start is just to just, just pick up and just do it, okay? Practice, practice, talk to yourself. You know, do whatever you want, but but it's all about practicing and getting comfortable with being by yourself and talking. I'm sitting here in an empty room talking to myself, basically, and, you know, you gotta get used to that. And just, you know, be enthusiastic, have fun. That's what life is all about, especially on YouTube. If you don't have fun, nobody has fun. Sam says, how do you keep your hair like that? Well, Sam, I actually just gave it a quick brush before that video, so that is why my hair looked decent. Usually it doesn't look quite that good. And my hair does not keep like that. So, yeah. I don't really keep my hair like that is the answer to that question. Claire from Canada. Oh, hey, Claire. I'm also from Canada. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to this video. Which Let's Play of your own is your favorite? And which game do you enjoy making Let's Plays of most? Thanks. I think I really enjoy making Let's Plays of Surgeon Simulator 2013. I haven't done a whole lot, but the couple that I did were pretty good. I liked them. And I think that may be one of my favorite videos was my, uh, my, my hit video, my, um, what's it called? The Alien Surgery, there you go. That thing was awesome. I got lots of views on that, so I really like it. And, uh, what else was a good video that I did? Well, my favorite video that wasn't a Let's Play was, uh, my music video. If you guys haven't watched that, then I hate you all! I'm just kidding. But, uh, I worked really hard on it, so I'd appreciate it if you gave it a look. It's, uh, the Chivalry Medieval Warfare. Thrift Shop parody. Oh look, we got this one done. Sometimes it takes forever to get that damn heart in there. David asks, why are you so pro? Well, when I get up in the morning, I pour myself a bowl of Captain Crunch. I crush it in little pieces and I snort it through a straw. Thanks for the question. Mojo the Gamer asks, how long did it take you to get this good at Surgeon Simulator? P.S. You rock. Happy face. Uh, I've got 69 hours logged on this game. I'd say it took me like 10 hours maybe to be decent at it. I don't know. I played the, uh... Fuck, what's going on? I did the... What's it called? Yeah, you tell me. What is it called? The... Record. The World Record Brain Transplant. I did that, and that got popular on Reddit. But I wasn't really even that good, and it wasn't even a... Holy shit. There you go. It wasn't even a good run, but uh, it was better than most people, so that's why it got popular. People thought it was funny. It was mostly the game that carried that one to the top of the of Reddit. I am prepared to do whatever it takes. What the hell happened here? Apparently, I switched page without realizing pages without realizing it, and then I read one from the bottom of the second page. Okay, well we're on the top of the second page here now, guys. We are getting through this these questions. Okay, let's let's get a new question going here. Matt or none, what happened to the old videos? Minecraft and stuff, I think I may have missed a bit explaining it, but I get why you stopped doing Minecraft specifically, everyone does it. Well, what happened there was I did a few videos and I didn't really feel like doing any more with the series. I didn't want to leave the series all like half done because the videos that I had weren't that great anyway. So I just said fuck it and just deleted them. I deleted a few videos that I didn't really think they were that great and high quality. You know, trying to keep the quality high and the quantity not necessarily low, but lower than a person who just uploads random crap all day. I try and put a little bit of work into the videos at least. MC Show for Gamefront asks, Will there possibly be any collaborative gameplay in the future? Yes, actually me and Hardcore Gaming Tips were planning on doing some videos together this weekend, but we've been planning on doing videos for a long time. That guy's apparently really busy, so we haven't done anything. But that's coming eventually so you can look forward to that if you enjoy collaborations and I don't know whatever else will happen in the future will be determined by how well people like me other youtubers oh crap 
get this we gotta get this going before we ask the next question. There we go. Next question. Wow no Dota asks, How long will you be making videos? Is just is this just a university thing or is it long term? Well, I hoped it would be long term. Not necessarily as a living kind of thing, but it's not necessarily just university because I mean I'll do it as long as I can, especially if people are watching. If people are watching my videos, why wouldn't I make them, right? It makes me happy, and it makes you guys happy. Why you do this? 396 asks, Why do you always make my day so much better? Happy face question mark. Well, I make your day better because... I'm awesome. But I actually think that you're the one who makes your day better by actually coming here and watching my videos. It is your choice, and you're doing it, so it's you that you have to thank for making your day better. Alright, we gotta go back to the space, and... Oh yeah, that's right, there's more There's more space transplants. I was thinking we were almost done. We're not. Matt, how are you such a good commentator? That's from Y, question mark, exclamation mark, cuz. I'm a good commentator because I'm so used to talking, because I do it all day long. Try it, it's a lot of fun. Just It pisses people off, but just just, just try talking all the time. And uh, maybe you will, you too will be a good commentator. Not that you aren't already, maybe you are, who knows? Let's do this with scissors, because who cares? Ah. Ah. Oh, there we go. Okay, next question. Generic name here says, Matt, how are you so good looking? Oh, wow. That's, uh, that's pretty straightforward, isn't it? Alright, well, I don't know. Most of the people in my family, my extended family, are pretty decent looking, so maybe it's because of that. I don't know. I won't exactly be posting pictures of my family for you to decide for yourselves, but, uh, yeah, we're all just decent looking people. I don't know, you can thank my mom and dad, for, I guess, for making me good looking. You should ask them. Maybe, maybe I was adopted. I'm not saying that my parents aren't good looking, but maybe I was, my parents are like supermodels or something. I'm kidding, I'm not that conceited. I think I'm a pretty average looking dude. Senor Hairy Legs Fetish says, are your legs hairy? Well, Senor Hairy Legs Fetish, you betcha, these things are like fucking forests or jungles or some shit. You gotta get a machete to get through it, okay? So, you're welcome for the images that I just put in your head, buddy. You can go fap yourself to sleep. Oh, what did I leave out here? Touch this. Here we go. Why not, spelled N-A-U-T, asks, which state are you from? I will find you. Just kidding. Well, I think you're gonna have a hard job finding me because I'm not from a state. I live in Canada, actually. It's a pretty great place. I live in Newfoundland, which is a, a, uh, a province, not a state. And uh, it's not a bad place. It's it's probably shittier than the rest of Canada. We're on an island, so it kind of makes it hard to, you know, do anything fun. I mean, there's plenty to do here, but, but it'd be better if we weren't on an island because I can't travel very easily. Everything's really expensive, like, travel-wise, flying out from here. Unless you, and if you don't know where Newfoundland is... You remember the terrorist attacks in 9-11? Of course you do. Uh, Gander in Newfoundland was the, one of the places that took in a lot of the people. They Apparently a lot, most of the flights were like rerouted to Gander, so there was so many people from uh, from flights in the United States coming to, to Newfoundland, to Gander, to seek refuge or whatever. I don't know, you wouldn't call it that, but they came here because they had nowhere else to go and shit was bad. My condolences. <clears throat> Where are we? Hmm. Rithin says, "What kind of shampoo do you use?" Well, I don't. I have actually have no idea. My girlfriend actually picks the shampoo because I really couldn't care less. Revton says, "I think it's actually maybe the same person as Rithin." What kind of headphones do you use? If not that, what speakers? Well, if you're let's playing, you pretty much have to use headphones because the audio from the speakers would totally interfere with the. Uh, you know, that thing. Oh yes, the microphone. It would totally interfere with your with your microphone audio and you'd get a lot of uh, of noise coming out of that and it would sound pretty bad. So I use a pair of Sennheiser HD 558s. Fun, f fun story about, th about these things. I actually ordered them when I was in the States because they are a hundred bucks cheaper in the States. Bought them off Amazon, got them shipped to my hotel room. It was a great time. And they're great headphones. I actually really like them. They're so comfortable, you wouldn't even know they're on your head. It's just it's just great. Hmm, what's next? 
Rith Lan, which I think is the same person again, asks, What was your first game console, and if you can remember, the first game you played? My first game console was a Super Nintendo. It was bundled with Yoshi's Island, and uh, I loved it. And it's probably one of my favorite games now, probably because of that. But uh, I just, I don't know, I really like Yoshi's Island. So that was my first, uh, my first game system and my first game. Thank you for the question. Where are we? Roth Lynn. What kind of computer do you use? If not store-bought, rather made by you, what part of the build would you recommend? I actually built my computer, and uh, I had a lot of fun doing it. And I have a GTX 670, and I have a Core i5-30... No, i5-3570K, is that right? Something like that. That's what I have, and those are two great parts. Other than that, I mean... It's all about really what's uh, bang for your buck in terms of reliability for like things like uh, power sources and stuff. Such I don't really even keep track of that stuff, but uh, you definitely need to have a great graphics card if you're going to play a lot of games on your computer. If you want them in good quality, that is. And if you're recording, it also uh, requires more intensive uh, work from your computer. Okay, what is this name you ask for? Asks. What do you enjoy most about being a YouTuber? I think what I enjoy most about being a YouTuber is having really awesome fans like you guys who watch my videos and say nice things about my hair and ask me uh, lots of awesome questions. That's my favorite part. So thank you very much for that, guys. Fat guy walking down the street asks, What type of game category do you like? I would say my favorite game category is adventure. I just like adventure games. They're a lot of fun. Simulators are fun, too. A lot of them are kind of boring. But adventure games, you know... I really like the Uncharted series. I played, uh, actually I only played the first two. I never ever got around to playing the third one. Kinda got bored after a while, but it was definitely a lot of fun at first. <laughs> Uncharted, uh, Uncharted 1 was, was, was the most fun, I think. Just cause it was such a new experience. It was when I got my new HDTV, so everything looked amazing. And yeah, it was just a great looking game. Hmm, what's next? Golden Guy says, What's your favorite subreddit? Mine is PC Master Race Happy Face. My favorite subreddit is what? Wait, 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 wait. What? What am I? What am I getting here? Fuck! I gotta restart. I don't remember what it was. My favorite subreddit probably is mildly interesting because it's just a mildly interesting subreddit. All the things you see are like kind of things you'd look at in normal in everyday life and say, "Oh, that's kind of cool." And there's a whole subreddit based on that. And I don't know. There's lots of really cool shit there, like weird icicle patterns and things, fun things like that. They're lots of fun. I like the subreddit. Chris P. Chicken says, how many toasters can you fit in your butt? Well, Chris P., it's been a long time since I tried to fit toasters in my butt, but I think my record was 17. Kyoto Moto says, I challenge thee to a surgeon simulate or show off. If you accept this challenge, please bark like a dog and then next available the next available representative of mine will contact you shortly. Okay, Kyoto Moto, you know what I got to say to that? Woof, motherfucker. Woof. Come get me. Derp says, what is your middle name? Hmm. What is my middle name? My middle name is Edward. Please no Twilight jokes. I hate Twilight jokes. Edward was actually my grandfather's name. I never met him either. Man, what is it with me and not meeting grandfathers? Oh, it might have something to do with the fact that when I was, for most of my life, I think maybe when I was born I only had like one living grandparent, so it kind of sucked for me. Mojo the Gamer says, how long did it take you to get good at this, at Surgeon Simulator? Oh wait, that's the one I already read. Remember I said I read one that wasn't supposed to be read? That was the one. Shit, something is happening to the alien. Oh, it's a piece of glass in his shoulder. I got it. It's okay. It's cool. Nazran Ashraf says, what did you use to record gameplay? I use DXTory. I find DXTory to be a lot better than uh, than uh, Fraps because it allows you to sort out the audio channels from microphone and gameplay audio. And I don't know what I'm doing here because I'm only supposed to gra grab the gobble shaft. I just don't want this to end, man. This is the last surgery. I was only planning on doing one of these surgeries, but I'll just do the surgeries until I finish the amount of questions that I have here, okay? So we'll do another one. What videos do you like to do most, says Hugo Tagliero. Um, I just like, like I said, doing videos on um, new games that come out. I do indie games mostly, and I like doing those games. 
either to help the developers out a little bit or just to, to show people something cool. Give something, someone something new to play. I play a lot of free games, so it's always nice to find a new free game to play, right? And let's transplant a Pewds ball. Steven asks, would you rather fight 100 duck-sized horses or one horse-sized duck? I actually feel kind of honored to be asked this question because everybody and their mother has been asked this question, but I haven't because I'm not a famous person. I would rather fight one horse-sized duck. And you know why? Because I feel like something to... I feel like the square cube law would help me out there somehow. You know, that's the thing that says that once you get so big, your volume and your and your surface area... Um, something to do with ants having a very low surface area, a large volume, and it going the other way around. Or I think I, I mix those up. Whatever. The point is, that's why ants can't be super huge. Same thing with spiders. Which is a good thing for us because nobody wants super huge spiders or ants. And I actually cut out the gobble shaft and didn't need to. Connor says, how long have you been gaming for? Well, Connor, I've been gaming since I was a little boy. I don't know how old I was when I got that Super Nintendo, but I've been gaming since then, I think. And probably before that, too. But I'm not really sure, because I can't remember. It was such a long time ago. I remember my cousin had, uh... Uh, he had Wario for... For the first Game Boy. And I played that a lot, and it was a lot of fun. And, uh... That may have been the first thing I played, I'm not really sure. Come on, Pewds Ball. What do I have to do to get you out of here? Get you back. No. Okay, next question. Galari Girl 129 says, Are you a brony? Who is the best pony? Absolutely not. Next question. What do you study at college or university? I'm glad you asked that question. That's a good question. I am studying neuroscience. Hoping to be a neuroscientist, perhaps. Actually, I want to go to medical school. But, uh, who knows? Who knows where I'll end up in the years to come. Miroku1325 asks, Who inspired you to make YouTube videos, and what keeps you motivated to make more wonderful, entertaining videos? Thank you for the nice comment. And I don't know if anyone really inspired me to make videos, but I used... I, I watch a lot of Robaz videos, and... Um, those are some of the first videos that I actually started watching on YouTube. The, uh... Started watching him when he put out that... How to be a badass, unarmed Viking in Skyrim, and I loved it. It was hilarious. You guys all know it. It was a funny video. And I gotta get this cut. Cut it! There we go. Fatal Effect asks. Oh wait, I already asked that. I already answered that question. Karim FN asks, "What is your shoe size?" I am a size 9.5 in U.S. measurements. Vordukas asks, "Why does your hair look so good?" Well. Like I said before, it usually doesn't look that good, so... Oh crap, oh crap, where did the... Who got rid of the Pewds ball? Is that it? Or is that the other Pewds ball? Come on, Pewds ball. Fuck. Oh, look, there's another one. Fuck. I gotta get that. I can't answer any more questions until I get the Pewds ball. Oh shit. Get out! Move your fucking head. Okay, okay, we, we can ask, ask an, answer another question now. Jamie the girl is in brackets, girl is in brackets. She says, are you single and are you straight? Well, I am not single, but I am straight. So if you were hoping that I was single, I apologize. This is the old Pewds ball, old Pewds ball, isn't it? Where's the new one? Is that ever coming back, do you think? Do you think the new, new Pewds ball is going to come back? I doubt it. Let's restart. Scrumptious. That's a great name, by the way. Scrumptious. I'm picturing all kinds of weird things in my head right now. Are you going to make videos of you using the Oculus Rift? Hmm. <laughs> Maybe if I ever get the Oculus Rift. Of course I'll get the Oculus Rift eventually, but the uh, it's only the dev kit out right now, and I'm, uh, I'm not planning on getting the dev kit. But uh, I would very much like to do some Oculus Rift gaming in the future, because, man, that thing is cool as shit. And shit is pretty damn cool. Nick Sinapoglu asks, What will be your schedule after 5,000 subscribers? Well, I don't know if I just randomly change my schedule all of a sudden, because I, I don't really have a schedule, but I, it wouldn't change. It's going to be the same. I'm just going to make videos when I have time and when I feel like it, and you're just going to watch them whenever I put them out, right? That's right. Black Dare asks, 
How do you look so much like your profile picture? I think the better question is, how does my profile picture look so much like me? And the reason is that Tiavo is a good artist. And I sent him a picture of me and told him, make me a profile picture that looks like this. And he did. Do you like it? I hope you do. Come on. Oh shit, how'd I rip that out? Get it! I only have one question left, so I'm, uh, I'm, I'm... I'm waiting and taking my sweet time, but this damn Robo Loras is not coming out. Come on, Robbie! Come on! Grabbing hold to his little weird things. Come on, buddy! Ah, oh, fuck you! You little bitch. Oh, crap. What am I gonna do now? What do I have to stick in there to get that out? Come on. Man, the video's almost over! Can't do this! Really? I did the entire game without struggle and my last thingy just decides to not work? Oh, you're such a bitch. Wait, 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 wait. I see your butt sticking out. Come on. What are you not grabbable? Seriously, what is your problem? Hit you. There you go. Okay, last question. Mike Hunt asked me to pronounce his name. Pronounce my name, please, he asks. Okay, Mike Hunt. I will pronounce your name, Mike Hunt. I hope you like that I'm pronouncing your name, my cunt. I like you, my cunt. My cunt is great. Thank you guys very much. This has been Matt Shea 369 Super Surgeon Simulator Subscriber Special. I hope you enjoyed it. That was all the questions that I decided to answer. I apologize if I didn't get to your question. It was either a repeat or I couldn't come up with a good answer for it. So thank you very much, guys, for sticking with me. Or if you're a new subscriber, thank you very much for subscribing. I appreciate you all. And I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.